Welcome to my fourth proof video about dragging items. In this video it's going to be very similar to my number three video. I'm going to do five collisions in uh, Sherbet Land and try to still beat uh, 242.5 for my time and just barely beat it. And that way if there's any penalty for dragging items I will know for sure because I'm going to drag items a lot in this race. I'm going to try to try but drag items behind me for over 50% of the time, so if there's any penalty at all, um, we'll see it. And uh, of course, I wouldn't be presenting this if I didn't know the answer already. And yeah, it's gonna, I'm gonna get three stars, and there's gonna be no penalty for dragging items behind you. Uh, I made this video because uh, this uh, belief that uh, dragging items behind you causes a penalty is uh, one of the beliefs out there that bothered me the most. I remember reading this one and I started following it and uh, I ended up getting hit by a lot more items and having a lot more trouble winning races and less chance of getting three stars. And it was, I feel like, the worst advice I ever had. Um, so that's the point of this video is just to prove that dragging items doesn't matter. Do whatever you want. Uh, drag them as much as you want, whenever you want. It doesn't matter. Uh, it's a good defensive strategy. It, Placing items is a good is a good strategy too, but uh, also drag him behind because yeah, the some shells like the red shells you'll know they're coming, but if somebody fires a green shell, you can just hear it. It doesn't give you that uh, warning on the screen that it one's about to hit you. So any doubt, and if you want to have uh, one item behind you and a activate and another one up above, so you have two again, that's a good strategy. So just. Don't worry about dragging items, that's the point of this. So it's up to you if you want to keep watching this. Uh, if you really believe that dragging items is a penalty, then I guess you'll want to watch the video more and check it out. Uh, if you don't believe it affects you at all, you can probably just stop this video and go on to the next one, because there's really nothing else in this. Uh, I'm just going to drag the items a lot here, and then the other races are going to be three-star races, and they're going to be pretty straightforward. There's really not much else to this video, so... I'm going to thank you for watching, and I'm going to stop uh, narrating here, and you can, like I said, watch it or go on to the next.